Hi everyone. This is Nate. And who are you? What do you mean? Are you my neighbor? No. Are you my friend? No. Who are you? Your, your son. This is Nathan. How old are you? He's my son. Seven. He's seven. And he wants to read a story too. He's our mystery reader today. How about that? Okay. Okay. I got this story called Just a Little Luck by Mercer Mayer was a good choice because um, we talk a lot about luck during St. Patrick's Day, right? Mm -hmm. And the author and illustrator is the same person in this story. The author writes the words. The illustrator draws the pictures, pictures which you already know. So I'm going to give the book to Nathan and he'll read it. Make sure they can see the pictures because that's one of the fun parts, right? Yep. If you have big siblings at home, it's fun for them to read to your preschooler, right? Yep. Okay, go ahead. And I like to be read to also. Sometimes okay. grown-ups like to be read to. Okay, go ahead. This book is called Just a Little Luck by Mercer Mayer. Make sure they can see the pictures, too. If he needs to read the words, he, of course, he'll open the book afterwards for you to see. Right, Nate? Yeah. Okay. I found a penny. I thought it would give me luck. It was heads or tails, asked Tiger. If it was heads, it's lucky. If it was tails, it's unlucky. I couldn't remember. I guess we will we'll have to wait and see. I Show them the picture. So sometimes what we do at school is we do a picture walk and we talk about what's happening in the picture, right? Yes. So here we can see the character, little critter, found a coin on the ground. And if he flips it, one side is going to give him luck and the other side is going to give him bad, bad luck. luck. So here he is finding the coin. And then here he is talking to his friends about what might happen once he flips it. Ooh. Just then, we heard the ice cream truck. We <gasps> wanted a double critterberry cone. I couldn't wait to eat it. Hmm, the ice cream, ice cream truck came. I wonder if his coin is bringing him good luck or, or bad, bad luck. luck. What do you think? Mm, good. Good. Yeah. If the ice cream truck came here, what kind of ice cream would you get? I wouldn't get ice cream. You <laughs> wouldn't? Okay. I would get a milkshake. Oh, I've never seen milkshakes on the truck before. Mm. I usually get the um like chocolate eclair thing. And I heard in Torrington there's an awesome ice cream name ice cream man named Peter. I hear all about him, so maybe someday Peter will be back in happier days, sunnier days, right? Avery, what kind of ice cream would you get? Strawberry. The strawberry one. With vanilla. Oh. Okay, go ahead. Next. Oh, we already read this page. Okay. Sorry, I want... Okay, there you go. But I dropped the ice cream. <gasps> Get rid of that penny, said Timothy. It's unlucky. I threw away the penny as fat, away as far as I could. I felt better, and soon it was time to go home. Wow. At first, I thought it, the penny was going to be good luck. Yeah, but now I think it's going to be Ooh. bad luck. It's going to be bad luck. He threw the penny away. Yeah. I wonder if that will work to get rid of the bad luck. What do you think? I think it will work. No, I think it won't work, actually. Now because he's ready he's still, to go home. Because he already flipped tails. Okay, let's see what happens next. I I had Over to... Here. But I got a flat tire. I'm still unlucky, I said. I had to push my bike home. Then I tripped and fell down. I was having a very unlucky day. Wah! <laughs> Wah! No. Wah! Look, his tire isn't working. He had to push his bike and he even fell down. How is he feeling, Avery? Sad. He's feeling very sad. I wonder what he could do to calm down. Hmm. Oh, I think hmm. I know. Tell me. Watch he TV. could. No. Well, I think maybe some breathing. Like a lot of my friends at school know, stop, take a deep breath, 
and relax. I think he just needs a hug. Oh, hugs work a lot of times yeah. too. Yeah, or he could get a band-aid. If he has a boo-boo, yeah. 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 Feels like bleeding. Oh, look at Avery. You were right. Your yeah. prediction was correct. Look at his mommy's hugging him. Mm -hmm. Mom hugged me and said, sometimes you just need a little luck. That made me feel better. Then he took that a bath. Night, I took a long bath. Baths, honestly, when yeah, you kids are good. feeling really, really anxious or uppity or just crazy, which all happens to us, just taking a quick bath or a quick shower really always works. It totally works for you, Nate, right? Mm -hmm. Just that warm water is really calming. Then I finished my project due for school next the next day. That made me feel better, too. Wow. I'm using scissors, glue... String, cardboard. But in the morning, I was unlucky again. I <gasps> dropped my project at the school steps. Somebody even laughed. So I made sure I, I, didn't, cr I didn't cry. Mm. It's okay if he needed to cry, right? Yeah. He's holding himself together, though. I'd be upset, too, if I worked really hard on that and then bro broke it. It's really disappointing. Mm -hmm. And what if someone did that to you at school, laughed at you, who could help you? Teachers. Teachers. But I, wouldn't, I wouldn't need help because, like, I don't care if someone laughs at me. It's just a little laugh. Well, you can help. I like laughs. And everybody reacts differently, right? Mm hmm All right. Oh, look who else can be a helper. A cat. No. <laughs> I like this teacher. She's a cat. Oh, mm -hmm. Go ahead and maybe you could sit up a little bit I more. I that one. Okay. I'm getting distracted by my own my own questions. That happens sometimes, but that's okay, right? We're in the on, world of books. On Tuesday, I left my lunch at the school bus. Gator lent me some lunch money. The cafeteria nice. was serving cream chicken with peas on toast. I hate that, but I was hungry. I ate it anyway. See, his friend helped him out. But then he didn't really like the lunch. Oh, no. Wednesday was worse. A delivery truck ran over my basketball in the driveway. I knew, Mom told, uh, I knew Mom told me to put it away, but I forgot. Mm -hmm. Got to put your toys away when you're done with them so they stay in good condition, right? 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 <laughs> Thursday, I had a little bit of bitty fever, and I had to stay home, which is fine usually. But Thursday is a special class party. How unlucky. This is a great page, right? Mm -hmm. If you're not feeling well, it's important to stay home, and that's why we're all home right now, to stay healthy. Mm -hmm. My fever was gone on Friday, but my TV station canceled my favorite show, Bonzo Bob and his wacky critters. I needed just a little look. Mm. He feels disappointed, huh? Yeah. He needs a mm. head coin. I wasn't even <laughs> excited about the weekend. Grandpa came by on Saturday. We were going to the state fair. Just Grandpa and unlucky me. I always wanted to ride the ripping rocket. Grandpa said, let's do it. The ride critters strapped us in. I, I just knew I would be unlucky and something would go wrong. Mm. So they went to the fair and his grandpa says, let's do it. Let's go on this ride. But now he looks scared. He does look a little scared. And, you know, I think maybe Little Critter needs to have a positive mind. He's, think, he's really thinking that something must be going wrong. But if we think like that, it's it's very stressful. So if you think, oh, it's okay, we can do this. We don't, we, maybe something great will happen. Then, you know, you're more hopeful. It's, that's how you're dealing with it. So guess what? But it didn't. It was great. 
Nothing bad happened here. Look how much fun they're having. Look at the smiles. Yeah. That looks fun, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Next night, Grandpa said. Oh, Grandpa said. What do you think of your luck now? What do you think of your luck now, little critter? I guess sometimes you just need a little luck. That's right. Sometimes you have bad days or bad moments, but it doesn't mean it's forever, right? Mm -hmm. The end. Okay, say bye, friends. Thank you bye. for joining us. We'll read more books and we will I upload the stories. I hope you enjoy my story. Thank bye bye. Thank you, Nathan.